Today I'm going to introduce you one of my 3D print project called R2D2. Because I'm staying near the Tampines area, so that's why I decided to uh, use the 3D printer in the make it at Tampines. The whole project took me around three years to finish because of the accuracy requirement and also some of the so-called uh, movement and, uh, by the electronics there. The original R2D2 is around double size of this one. This is only a half size. I did hit half size because of the few things first budget. So half size means less material, then I can save some money. And then the uh, second thing is half size, then that means uh, it's e quicker to finish the painting. If you look at this, the whole project here, it consists of two parts. One part is the 3D pin of the whole things. Second part is the electronic inside. This feed, uh, the R2D2 here, it can move by using a remote controller. This is a, just a normal you are using for the, to control the helicopter, all these, all these small things. Uh, you can see actually, the, I want to make it the uh, same as the movies, so it can have music and sound. So you can see at the two sides here, there are two speakers. One speaker is for the music, one speaker is for the, the beat sound here. And then also, uh, it can also have some robot arm coming out, just like this tool and also this tool. So uh, actually the most difficult part is the LED on these two sides here because it's purely software driven. Uh, so it's not hardware to make this one. It's only using Arduino and then using programming combined together and make all this so-called uh, blinking. I don't think it's more than a few hundred dollars. But of course uh, the 3D printing here, I make use of the make a space facility uh, to, to clean it. So it also helped me a lot <laughs> in the course. Uh, the maker space helped me start to handle how to handle 3D printer, how to control the parameters, how to uh, set the settings. These are very, very important things for you to have a good 3D print. Every 3D printer is a little bit different. But to have a general understanding, it helps you to easily to, uh, get hold of the technology. And then when you do the 3D printer in the maker space, speed up your learning. If there are ideas that you want to try, come to Make It at Libraries. <laughs>